We're Clayton on Glendor, and today we're going to be taking a look around this commercial unit. Originally two separate units on two separate titles. It could have originally been two terraced homes. But let's take a look on inside and take a look around. And so there's loads of potential here. It's originally set up or set up at the currently as a nursery. So let's go on inside and take a look around. So let's say you can see the wall here, which originally would have been the two separate units, but at the moment it's all been opened up. So I say it's a rather large unit, so we're going to move around it pretty quickly, but just give you a good idea of the size and the space. So it could be rented. It has been rented as a nursery, as you can see, for quite some time now. But it could be the potential, I think, maybe even in, in actually splitting it back into two separate units, maybe retail downstairs and maybe apartments upstairs. I said, because they're on the two separate titles, essentially you're buying the two different units. So back up here, you've got the bathrooms and the sinks and they're outside to the back. What you've got is there's an extension at the back, which you'll see from upstairs, which gives you the emergency exit from the, from the offices there. So you get a large open plan space here downstairs. Would make a good mini mart. You know, there's a lot of people that rent in the area. You know, there's not many shops, so there could be an option there potentially. And um, both of the properties, either side, come with full cellar. So there's a cellar underneath both sides. Um, and just here at the back on the ground floor, you can see a big kitchen there as well. So originally, there'd have probably been kind of two reception rooms and a fitted kitchen, and then they have the garden space out the back. We'll just go out the back now while we're here, just to get a gauge on the side. So I say at the back here, you've got this space, which I think is important to show just what's out the back here. I say the nursery, the unit finishes there, but if you have a look from here at the front, you can see one, there's this rather great commercial, like um, shared space for, for play, whatnot, and seating areas. But at the back, you can see the development. So you can see where the emergency exit is there. There is a potential, I think, to do it on this side as well. And maybe even give you access to, to a flat or so here from the back alleyways where you get a gated key. So it's all nice and safe and secure. Okay, so that is, that's downstairs. The downstairs area. Let's go and take a look around upstairs. So we'll go up this here. So there's one staircase that connects to, and what you get is a numerous office spaces, which like I say, could be set out the same as offices, could be turned back into residential. So big office in the front, and we'll do this unit first. So this is number 10 Glendor, and here again, another one, which would have probably originally been the second bedroom. And then what you get here at the back is you get a bathroom and another room. So they would make three bedroom terrace homes, or they've got essentially three offices and a, and a bathroom up here. We're gonna cut through here. So this would have been the original door between eight, eight and 10 there. And again, you come into another office space. And at the front here, another office space. Again, would have probably been a master bedroom. And at the back here, bit of storage space, probably would have been the old bathroom and a further kitchen. So you've got two kitchen areas there, um, the bathroom there, and then what you've got here is just that gives you your emergency access to the rear that we saw a short while ago. So I think there's heaps, heaps of potential here. One, as a commercial unit, as maybe one unit, one tenant, but also to maybe even consider splitting it into two separate commercial units and maybe redoing the upstairs into maybe apartments or maybe office spaces that are accessed from the rear. I said a lot of people are getting drawn to the area because it's close to Salford Quays, Media City, excellent transport links into town, Salford Royal Hospitals around the corner. So you can see the demand that's coming for it. So um, yeah, that is it, eight to 10 Glendor, two commercial units and office space upstairs that could offer a variety of uses to the right buyer. They're both on separate titles, so that could be an added bonus. All very secure as well. And thank you very much for watching. A real interesting unit. If you're interested, that's the kind of thing you want more details on it, get in touch. It's 0161 707 4900 or send us an email to sales at hillsresidential.co.uk. And thank you very much for watching.